Cultures, welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Sean Megahagan from BS Ed English. Today's discussion will tackle about the definition of values, hierarchy, and values hierarchy. Who is Max Keller and what is his hierarchy of values? Who is Max Keller? Max Keller is a German philosopher known for his works in phenomenology, ethics, and philosophical anthropology. He is also known as the foremost exponent of axiology. Axiology is the philosophical science of ethics. Max Keller was born on August 22, 1874 and died on May 19, 1928. Before we proceed on Max Keller's hierarchy of values, let's first define some terms. Values comes from the Latin word valere, which means to measure the worth of something. Values are like some human principles that are extremely valuable or desirable. Then hierarchy. Hierarchy is the arrangement of things or items which are represented as above, below, or at the same level. Hierarchy of values refers to, to the ordered list of social values that influence judicial decision making in one's lives or society. It determines how people perceive or what his actions will be. Now let's proceed to Max Keller's hierarchy of values. Let's start with pleasure values. From the word pleasure, it means a feeling of satisfaction. Pleasure values pertain to the pleasant versus unpleasant or agreeable against disagreeable. Examples for pleasure values are sensual feelings and experiences of pleasure or pain. Specifically, for example, as students, if we get high grades or high scores or if we pass the exam, we feel happy, we feel excited, we are glad. And on the other hand, if we get low scores, we feel sad and we feel down. So that is an example of values under pressure values. Next, we have vital values. Vital means of at the utmost importance. These are concerned with or necessary to the maintenance of life. Vital values pertain to the well-being of an individual or of the community. There are characteristics of vital values. First, refer to health and diseases or life and death. Second, pursues deeper emotional purposes. Then it involves the mental and the environment that surrounds the human being. There are types of val vital values. First, the healthy, then healthy, the strong, and the weak. Examples of vital values are health, vitality, capability, and excellence. So for, um, for instance, for physical, examples are like rest, sleep. We need that in order to be healthy, in order to live, or in order to continue existing. Then we go on with spiritual values, or what is called values of the mind. These values refer to the discovery of meaning and purpose of life, and demonstrating these values through behaviors. These values answer the question, what does it mean to be humans? What does it mean to be me? What does it mean to be you? These values are grasped in the spiritual acts of referring to loving or hating. Kinds of spiritual values. First, we have the values of beautiful and ugly. Second, the values of just and unjust. Third, the values of pure knowledge. Examples is the beauty against ugliness. For instance, we have this pandemic. Instead of dwelling on the negative side, we chose to be positive. We chose to have a positive mindset. Then the last one at the uppermost level of Max Keller's hierarchy of values is the values of the holy. It appears only in regard to objects intentionally given as absolute objects. Values pertain to belief or unbelief, God or other. So examples are belief, adoration, and bliss. For example, for me, I am a Roman Catholic, and I believe in God, I believe in His holiness and mightiness, I adore Him, and admire Him, and my trust and belief in Him is immeasurable. 
Based on Max Keller's hierarchy of values, the highest values are those that pertain to the supreme being, while the lowest are those that pertain to sensual pleasures. According to Scheller, we act and live well if we stick to his hierarchy of values, such as giving greater preference to the higher values. We will live miserably if we distort Scheller's hierarchy of values, like for instance when we subordinate spiritual values to pleasure values.